University of Florida is an academic a medical center. We deliver care in an outpatient setting as well as through our central uh, tertiary quaternary hospital uh, where high-end um, medical care is delivered to our patient population. The mission of the Department of Pathology, Immunology, and Laboratory Medicine is to bring forward to the community new technologies that will enhance our capacity to develop new diagnostics, prognostics, and diagnostic testing. Really the work we do is, is front and center in terms of, what, of everything that happens in the hospital. Um, we are responsible for all the tissue-based and cell-based diagnoses that are put out in the hospital. And so really what we do every day drives clinical care. The Division of Anatomic Pathology is arranged in subspecialties. Autopsy pathology, cytopathology, and surgical pathology. All are done in a subspecialty model. The surgical pathology is divided into 14 subspecialty units and each unit essentially functions almost as a one-on-one -on -one with the clinicians that they serve. So it really provides us a fantastic way to provide service for our clinical colleagues and uh, we hope that, that they have a lot of confidence in us knowing that the right people are making the diagnoses for them. One of the main missions of the Division of Anatomic Pathology is, uh, is to educate our trainees. So we're really trying to train the pathologists of tomorrow. Um, we want them to learn cutting edge pathology. We offer very diverse training. Our residents get in-depth exposure to both clinical and anatomic pathology. We have faculty that are enthusiastic and experts in their field. Our residents, by nature of doing this subspecialty sign out, get exposure and work very closely with all of our clinical colleagues. Really, it's, um, it's an ideal way to train. It sets them up for being a fundamental part of the medical care team. We really treat them as an individual, um, depending on where they want to be when they finish their training, whether it be private practice or if they want to enter into academic medicine. We give them an excellent basis for that. We also train with the intention of finding good fellowship programs for them as well. Importantly, we're all very excited at the faculty level as well as with our residents and fellows about the developments uh, that will take pathology to the next level. The mission of the Division of Experimental Pathology uh, within the Department of Pathology at the University of Florida is to conduct a basic and clinical research to understand mechanisms of diseases. The focus is mostly uh, research on autoimmune diseases. We have developed a number of clinical trials that have been implemented here uh, at the University of Florida. We have studies preventing type 1 diabetes. We have studies designed to predict patients that are going to have type 1 diabetes, and also we have studies that are designed to, to reverse type 1 diabetes in patients that already have the disease. We are working closely with our clinical colleagues directly on the research projects through samples that we get from, uh, from the clinical uh, side of the department. Research and development activities at the University of Florida Pathology Laboratory and at the Clinical Translational Science Institute at the University of Florida lead to the development of new tests that can be offered in the clinical setting. At the University of Florida Pathology Laboratory, our testing menu has been expanding significantly in molecular pathology, uh, both in testing related to uh, neoplasms or oncologic-based molecular pathology testing, but also in the realm of pharmacogenetic uh, testing as well. Um, one area where we're looking to expand in the future is in um, expanding the mass spectrometry program to include not only toxicology-based testing, but also to get into proteomics and metabolomics. We've been able to genotype patients in the laboratory and put this information into our medical record to help our physicians decide which drugs um, are appropriate for a patient given the patient's genotype. This is an example of how we're taking um, basic science, moving it through translation and into clinical practice. UF Path Labs uh, recently launched a new laboratory devoted to clinical toxicology. Uh, we're servicing the Department of Psychiatry Pain Management Clinic and uh, shortly we're expanding our services 
to provide drug confirmations for Shands Hospital. Thereafter, we'll be servicing the, the local community through outreach in both the pain management arena as well as providing uh, drug confirmations for our physicians. The delivery of patient care at the University of Florida Pathology Laboratories is uh, very important. Uh, pathologists are often behind the scenes. We're in the laboratory, but uh, deep down what we care most about doing is providing excellent patient care and services. The ultimate contributions that we can make to clinical science as well as to clinical practice are to be able to provide testing services that would help uh, support clinical trials, help to identify patients at risk, help to identify individuals who would benefit from a specific therapy and to be able to, when appropriate, translate these in, into the community.